It's been a while since I made a planned list video, so I thought, well, that's a great topic. Here is five wonderful plants for all the trailing, hanging plant lovers out there. Let's start with a really versatile one which can go all the ways around, and it is the Sebo Blue. Now, this one is wonderful because you can grow it hanging or going up, on a moss pole. The growth is great, it's really fast and if you give it a lot of light you also get these wonderful fenestrations here. I have to clean the dust, I know, but this one is really worth it. And let's move on to the second plant, which is this wonderful philodendron lime. Now this one I have it growing like hanging out of the shelf and the growth again is great. These plants will never disappoint you, I should state that. The colors make the room enchanting. And also the propagation is really mysteriously easy because you can see these little things here. You just cut it, put it in water and there you have an unlimited amount of plants. And next on the list, we have a stunning plant, which is the fishbone cactus, or any epiphyllum could work this way. You can grow it hanging from a pot, trailing along a fence, or, well, a piece of wood or something. And a heartwarming story about my fishbone cactus is that last year we were on vacation on a Greek island called Leros, and we were going for a walk and I saw a really huge, I mean huge, it must have been like 20 years old, fishbone cactus and I just froze there, standing there and looking at the cactus and there comes the lady that lived on this house and she cut it some pieces and I got the chance to propagate it for free and that's the moral of the story, when you like something just stand there and stare at it till the plant bar end of it comes out of the house and just gives you with some pieces to propagate it and well it's growing great and number four is a plant that i would recommend to everyone without second thoughts because it's really rewarding is the monstera minima this thing grows like crazy now keep in mind that if you put it on a moss ball like i am planning to do with this one it will grow really huge leaves and it will be stunning. But stunning enough will be also a Monstera Minima that you grow it hanging out of the pot. It is your choice the way that you decide to grow it, but this plant is something that should be on everyone's collection. And last on the list we have a really controversial plant because some love it and some hate it but I think that it is worth the love and it is the Hoyas of course because they are really easy to care, they can grow going up, going down, trailing around and they can create a really boosty look if you have a lot of plants inside a pot and they grow like this, succulent, strong leaves and stunning looks. Also they come in a lot of colors so you can choose the one that suits you the best. 